up Now you know I'm coming through When the growth look good on you Best believe they wanna screw now I've been trying to climb Devil threw me in the dark Baby, don't be insecure You can still go make a mark like Blow. Could never let them drain my soul now Blow. Table turning like doorknobs Wow Blow. I think I'm about to set sail I'm a walking living legend Walking with my chest yeah. now Life keeps dealing me cars I keep What's happening, people? What is happening? It's G. You already know the vibes. You know the ties, guys. Please make sure, as per usual, you l smash. <laughs> I'm about to say that wrong. You smash that like button. You share and subscribe to the channel. I know the episode slowed down a little bit. It's been crazy. A lot of things going on. A lot of lives, of course, during the morning times, as you guys have been joining in. So big up to everybody who has. Big up to those who are new to the channel. This is just another segment to my GTV, where we're just trying to do all things football and obviously my favourite game in the entire world, which is Football Manager. So I said, let's just start a series. Um, to, decided to choose Crystal Palace and we are here. We're now on to episode six. So if you haven't watched the previous episodes, you're going to have to start from back to front. I'm sorry, because you need to follow the journey. So for those who already know, and for those who have obviously followed the last few episodes, we're here. We're back after the international break. It was a bit of a long break as well. I had to also take a few days off of the game because, you know, you get too consumed with this game and it takes up so much time. But we're back. We're back and we've got Manchester United at home. You guys can obviously see to the right hand side. You can see we're sitting fourth in the league. Of course, we still need to play this game. Beat Manchester United. We are a point away from them in the table. So, you know what I mean? Right now, yeah, we've been on good form as well, guys. We've been on good, good form. If I go to my... Uh, look, we're unbeaten. We're unbeaten this season. Haven't lost a game. We've literally only drawn three games. One was a friendly and two in the Premier League. 3-3 three, three against Arsenal was obviously um, our last game. Um, so, yeah, you know, Eze, been fantastic for me, you know, this season. So, without further ado, let's just get into the match against Manchester United. Let's go. So, here we go against Manchester United. Hopefully, we can get the win. I mean, we did draw against Arsenal in the last game. United with a corner now. Let's see where this takes them. Luke Shaw, please do not score. Ball into the box. Keeper. That's it. Clear away, lads. Don't let them play around. Ooh, unlucky there. Good block by Gay. Fernandez with the corner now. Two minutes into the game. Well done, keeper. United have been dominating this game, man. I can't even lie. 13 minutes in. I won't be surprised if they do get the first goal of the game. Might even just, like, kind of... Just get us going, to be honest with you. We're not really getting shots off and stuff like that. So let's just hope that we can do something. Good little nick away there. Come on. 16 minutes in. Can we get the breakthrough? Who's going to get the first goal of the game? Manchester United have been all right this season as well. Hold on, Saki. Is that Eze again? Oh, Eze hits the post. We have had that chance. He's going to be sent off. Yep, I could tell. I, could, I just knew he was going to be sent off. Yeah, that's sending off, man. It's going to put us on the back foot regardless, to be honest with you. So, not expecting victory from this game, but we'll wait and see. We'll wait and see. Unbeaten runs do have to come to an end at some point, so I'm not going to be too disappointed. Context and everything. Let's see what we do. Just don't give away silly goals. That's all I ask. That's literally all I ask. Ooh, Edward, Eze. Oh, Eze with a nice little chip. Nice little chip. I've got Eze playing like... Kind of attacking midfield, but still in that midfield area because obviously I don't want to be left there. There, got a couple of players on yellow cards as well, so we definitely need to make sure we're being careful. Half time cannot come any bloody sooner. And United just popping it around at the back there. Anthony out there on the wings. Oh God, can they at least get a man sent off themselves? Like that'd be good. That'd be really good. Oh, good shot there. Good shot by Casemiro. Got to be careful of these. Good handle. And United again. Yeah, you know I mean, they're, they're going to have a lot of the ball. So we just got to kind of just stick it out, to be honest with you. See what we can obviously fashion up ourselves. Any little half chances we can get, that would be really, really good. United there with another shot. They are having a lot of chances. I'll show you guys here. They've had seven chances in the game so far. 
you've got two. Make some halftime subs because I said otherwise it just gets silly, man. We've got too many players on yellow cards and stuff like that. I even took off Klein who came on. <laughs> I said, nope, we are not risking that, mate. I promise you. Careful. Is that I with the ball there? Can you lay it back for someone? Who's going to shoot? Yeah, I don't know. Bruno Fernandez. Ooh, almost free kick there. United again on the attack. Lindelof with the ball at the back to Varane, out to Shaw. Box it into Rashford, back to Shaw, to Casemiro, Fernandez, Varane, Wambasaka, Mount with a shot. Can we break forward? Can we hit on hit them on the counter? They're having so many corners, man. It's only a matter of time. Ooh. Just be careful. Careful at the back there. He's gonna he's gonna do something dumb. I can just feel it. Remember, guys, we ain't got no striker. <laughs> do you know what I mean? You gotta be careful when you're trying to do those kind of things. We ain't got someone we can just pop the ball into. Rashford making a run out wide to Fernandez. He's gonna shoot. Good save. Hughes with a free kick. Oh, unlucky there. Hughes unlucky. All right, we've got a corner. Yeah, waste as much time as possible, my bro. Waste as much. God. Why don't you let it back to Hughes? Five minutes of injury time. Do you think we can look at Nate one? Oh, unlucky. Oh, silly ball out. Silly, silly ball out. Before you can see the pen there. That was so criminal. Nacho, well done, and that's it, all over, nil-nil with 10 men as well in the 23rd minute, now I'm happy with that, I am extremely happy with that man, Do not complaining, I'll be honest with you, nil-nil against Manchester United, and um, we had a player sent off in the 23rd minute, come on man, eight games unbeaten as well, can't really complain man, really, really and truly cannot complain, I'll be honest. Cool. Our next game is against Everton, and then we've got West Ham, and then yet yeah, we'll cut it there uh, before our Carabao Cup fourth round against Fulham. That will be episode seven. Uh, let's see who we've got for this game, and I'll see you guys on the other side. Let's go, let's go. Obviously, we drew our first game against United. Let's see if we can get a W here. Everton with a corner. Looks like Eze might have to come off. He may just have to come off. Kind of happy because I've got Matisse Tell back for this game as well. You know what I mean? Kind of missed him. Missed his kind of energy. Oh, and Everton take the lead. But is it going to be an offside? Come on, ref. Blow that. Offside. Pause. Offside, offside, offside. Ah, goal awarded. Come on, Pat. Not another sending off. Oh, my God. All right, into the second half. We're down to 10 men again for the second game running, man. I'm going to have to look at that one, man, because I can't be having players just always sent off. Come on, man. Let's at least try and get a goal or something. Anderson, why are you going back? Anderson, into go Hart. Play in the box. Can you just put in the box? Oh, unlucky, unlucky, unlucky. Good move, though. Good move. Good by Walton. It's so annoying having a player sent off, man. It just messes up your whole feng shui, like, <laughs> do you know what I mean? Now the whole team is just kind of like, we just, oh, no, go. Yep, knew it. Game done, game done. That's going to be our first defeat. Ah! A new coming to Merseyside was just going to be tricky, man. Poor performance anyway, man. We deserve to lose this game. Lerma, you ain't starting the next game. Well, you know, you got suspended anyway, so it's not going to matter, to be honest with you. You've let us down today. But, you know, we could have at least got a point out of this game, at least. Like, Oh, the Corey, of course. Two players sent off. Poor performance from Crystal Palace. Yeah, it's not been good a good day at the office, but I guess it was about time. 
let's just get that defeat early and let's see how this team actually bounces back from defeats like that. Like, do you go on a run of defeats? Is it going to be one of those ones? Let's wait and see. Yeah, not really too happy with that, of course. Um, we dropped down to sixth place in the league with our first defeat of the season. There's only now, what's that, two unbeaten teams left in the league this season. That is Arsenal, no, three, sorry. Arsenal, United and City. We were part of that batch, but first, you know what I mean? We only got one defeat of the season with 18.7 off the top, one off of fourth as well. So still doing well, man, still doing well. We can still be a little bit happy. You've got West Ham who are sitting in third place. We need to get that victory to at least go above West Ham. Definitely need that victory, guys. So I will catch you guys for that preview in a second. And now we are back. We're going to make this one a, probably a bit of a short episode today, but we obviously we, we would have gotten through three fixtures um, in today's episode. Um, we're up against West Ham, London derby. Can we get the victory? Can we go above West Ham in this game? Let's find out. Catch you guys on the flip side. Let's go, guys. Come on. Can we get this victory before we close out in today's episode? So that'd be really, really good. My best players have already had to come off in Eze. So not looking great at the moment, but we're on the attack. We are on the attack. Gohart, who's in the box for him now? Who's showing for him? Oh, unlucky tell. Unlucky. Kudos, Paqueta, Bowen. Jesus Christ. Yeah. They should be winning this game, really and truly. When you look at their team in comparison to mine, that's probably why they're sitting third in the league. Do you know what I mean? But we got we got faith, we got belief, man. You know what I mean? Let's do this thing, man. Don't try to concede after I've just rallied the whole team up. Oh, Palace that. Oh, goodness. We've not really been in the game, man. They're having a lot of shots at our goal. Um, if anything, they're probably playing the better of the two teams, if I'm being totally honest. Could this now? Don't give away a penalty. Well done. Good save, good save, keeper. Corner just before half time. Ball into the box. Can we get it away? Well done, keeps. Back now to Anderson. Keep going back. What is all this? Well done, Hughes. Hughes into Schluck. Can Gelhart, can you finish? Oh, flipping days, bro. Eze scores that. Eze definitely scores that, man. That's why I need Eze. Oh, unlucky. Good shot. Good shot. God, I can't wait for Elise to come back as well. Jesus Christ. Bit of quality in the team, man. Tony with the long ball. Can we get it off of him? Don't let him shoot. Good save, keeper. Ball into West Ham. Halftime. Come on, man. Second off. Can we get a goal? Can we get a goal? Not really threatening enough for my liking anyway. You know, a nice little passing like this, but just not really threatening. I may have to change it up. They've had about eight shots at goal. If they score, I'm going to have to change it up a bit. Tell. All right, Gerhard, make, that, make a run. Not like that, you twat. Wait. Well done. Emerson, good block by the wall. Good block, good block, good block. So many free kicks I've conceded to this season, to be fair. Keeper, well done. Good commanding of the box. Let's see if we can get a change up front. Frank Saki, Richard, Saki. Oh, unlucky Saki. The Villa vs Arsenal game looks very interesting. All right, guys, come on. Can we pop well done, Schlock? Out to Edward, back to the right back. That's it. Hey, why are you not moving forward, though? Like, what do you expect him to do in that position, bro? Fucking hell. Edward, up to Mitchell, put it in the box. Well done, Jordan Ayew with the goal. Thank you. Done something. 
Ayu's first goal this season. Wow, but Anderson taking free kicks, that's crazy. He must be the best. <laughs> he must be the best. Can we hold on now to this lead here or can we add to it potentially? Anderson to Hughes. Don't lose the ball here, lads. Schlup out wide. You've got space now. Time and space. That wasn't the ball to pick out. Uh, bring him down or something. Well done. Good block. Good block. That's it. Now, you push. Finish, Gelhart. Well done, Gelhart. Put the game to bed. Very good finish. Very good finish. I think that's game done and dusted. All right, then with a corner here. Are they going to get a consolation? Well done. Clear your lines, lads. Clear your lines. That's it, Gelhart. Back to Edward. Edward, see if you can win a free kick. To Schlop. Out wide, Schlop. Out wide. Maybe offside. Oh, Franca finish. Oh, unlucky, Franca. Unlucky. He's played all right since he's come on, you know. Played all right. I think, yeah, we're going to get the victory out of this. We're going to get the victory. Pulled into the box. You trying to get another one? We're just going to knock it about. Yeah, game done, game done. All right, so that's a victory, a draw, and a loss. I can take that. I can take that. I can take that. 2 0 victory against our London rivals. I can take that. No problem with me. So, as you guys can obviously see there, we are sitting currently fourth in the league. We have overtaken West Ham. Obviously, I'm annoyed because like, my unbeaten run is over. That, that kind of annoyed me. I can't lie. Um, I wanted to at least keep that, considering we, we didn't lose in the other two games that we, of course, played. So, yeah, it's a little bit annoying, but we're still sitting fourth in the league. You know what I mean? Seven points off the top. Um, point ahead of West Ham. We're in fifth. Point behind Arsenal. I really can't complain with the start that I'm actually having. Maybe I'm asking for too much because I'm sure if Crystal Palace had this start at the beginning of the season in real life, yeah, things would be looking a whole lot different. So, guys, we'll end it there for today's episode. As you can, you probably saw it there already. We've got the Carabao Cup. It's annoying. Just look, just look at that. Like it's just annoying. Just having that stupid defeat in there after drawing to Manchester United and Arsenal, you lose two 0 against Everton. Like it's annoying, man. But it is what it is, man. That's that's football for you. Um, but listen, I'm still happy. Uh, Carabao Cup fourth rounds uh, coming up, and then we've got Brentford away, Chelsea at home, Tottenham away. Yeah, tough games, man. We got that's going to be a very this next episode uh, that that I do. This is going to be a tough month. I can see that already. And then the following month, we've got uh, City, Liverpool, Brighton, Forest. Like that's going to be a crazy month. We'll probably do. We'll probably break down this the December month into two kind of parts. Uh, well, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll break it down anyway. We'll sort it out when the time comes because I know if I get through this Carabao Cup round, it's going to be another fixture going to be added on. So, yeah, we'll wait and see. We'll wait and we shall see. But, um, yeah, in the Premier League, sitting fourth, can't really complain if I'm being totally honest with you. Guys, please make sure you smash a like, share and subscribe to the damn channel. Uh, stay tuned for the next episode. Um, don't even know when I'm going to drop this episode, but the next one after that will be very, very soon anyway. Uh, please enjoy your bank holiday weekend and I'll be back in no time with another episode of Football Manager. It's G, GTV. Peace.